Thanks to Martin for those two group races. Back to Bida for the handicaps. Uh, summer handicap over one mile six. Frankie's Blade, Graham Clutterbuck, Ray Ross, David Robertson, uh, Punta Rossa, Darren Thompson, William Ruffus, William Rufus, Kevin Wiedigan, Basker Briggs, Joshua Sutherland, Danny Magic, Patrick Hogan, Oath, Craig Beckwith, Music Girl, Dave Rudy, Patch Patch, Stu Gray, Isha Duchess, Vinnie Gerard, big price for Vinnie Gerard horse, Rainbow River, Martin Needham, Hills Patchy, Dan Hughes, Zephonic Bell, Graham Clatterbuck, Still Game, Alex Cherry, Against the Oz, Michael Scala, Society Sphere, CGJ Liggett, Sunline, Kevin Minigan, and the two W1 horses dancing on Arsenal Orchestra. 19 horses, big field here at Goodwood. Here the summer handicap. And away they go. A good break by Punta Rasa for Darren Thompson as Punta Rasa goes to leave and Busker Briggs on his inside. Just behind that is the Patrick Hogan also dancing a uh, Danny Magic but dancing on ice as a side the pace is too slow and dancing on ice for Obi Wan goes to the front from Busker Briggs for Joshua Sutherland. Up on the rail is still game, uh, pulling hard out in the centre of the track quite wide is Houston Duchess, Patch Patch just on that one's inside. Then comes Danny Magic with the orchestra behind it with Music Girl in Sunline and Hills Patchy against the odds is trapped very wide and as is Frankie's Blade and also William Rufus. Then behind that is Society Fear. On the rail is Savonic Bell. Race Ross is on that one's outside. And the second Darren Thompson was Punta Rasu, who was the early leader, has dropped right to the back of the field. As he should Duchess overcome, coming from, overcoming the wide draw to join the leader, dancing on ice in front. Still going about two lanes further back with Patch Patch on his outside. Then a Buster Briggs. Up on the rail is Rainbow River for Martin Leadham. Out the centre of the track is Sunline. Just behind these is Danny Magic. Was a phonic bell on that one's outside. Then Craig Beck was horse, Oath, was against the odds, travelling wide. Also travelling wide is Frankie Blade. A point to Rossa. He's just behind that with uh, on his inside Ray Ross. Then comes Orchestra, uh, followed by Music Girl for Dave Uy, who's going very wide. Hills Patchy behind that. And then comes S S S William Rufus at the back of the field. So dancing on ice the leader from Hesha Duchess in second. Then comes Busker Briggs with Still Game just behind that. They're followed by Danny Magic with Patch Patch on the inside. Sunline up the um, going about five wide. Rainbow River trying to sneak up the inside. And uh, then comes the uh, Sophonic Bell with Oath. Society Sphere is behind that. Um, some horses going really wide and some of the, including the Hills Patchy. Uh, Music Girls going wide. Uh, orchestra is also very wide. Frankie's Blade's always been wide, about six wide at this stage. And up the inside Ray Ross is trying to get up the inside of the track. They, they're all trying to move to the inside now as uh, Downton last leads with about four and a half furlongs left to go from Busker Briggs in second. Isha Duchess for Vinnie Jarrett is back in third. Then comes Stall Game. Sunline has travelled wide the whole way. On his inside is Danny Magic trying to get closer. Uh, Punta Rosso is moving closer as well. Rainbow River looks to have a double handful. Looks like uh, we put our pace at this stage as Dancing on Ice leads from Danny Magic is trying to move forward for Patrick Hogan. Behind this Buster Riggs. Then comes Punta Rosso still game is right there. Patch Patch is trying to run on. It's dancing and I still in front from Danny Magic up the side of the track. Who still looks like he's got a lot in the tank. It's dancing and I but yeah, comes Danny Magic for Patrick Hogan. And Danny Magic is coming to grab dancing and I with a fur and a half to go. Danny Magic picks it up, running around from the back of society. Fears Buster Briggs up the inside, up the center of the track. We have Hills Patchy, but it's Danny Magic has got first run on them. And Danny Magic from Punta Rosso and Rach Ross is trying to run on up the inside. Buster Briggs, but Danny Magic. He's going to win for Patrick Hogan. Danny Magic wins the summer handicap from Punta Rosso in second. Ray Ross was third. Busty Briggs was fourth. And I think uh, Hills Patchy might have got fifth. Danny Magic always travelled well. was always close up. And he wins comfortably in the end. Got first run on the rest of the field. Danny Magic wins from Punta Rosso in second. Ray Ross was third. Busty Briggs was fourth. And Hills Patchy finished fifth. And there's a lot of horses who went really wide in that race. And probably put pay to their chances. I can think of... Uh, one of the grand cutbacks also travelled wide the whole way with the winner Danny Magic for Patrick Hogan.